15 Days Novena for Victory Daily Prayers Prayer 1 Father God, I come before you in the name of your Son, Jesus Christ, praising you with all my heart, mind, and strength for the victory you have given me through Jesus Christ, my personal Lord and Savior. The Bible says that Jesus Christ has redeemed me from the curse of the law. Therefore, sickness, disease, Pain, suffering, poverty, and death has no power over me. I am now free from the law of sin and death. The Spirit of Christ Jesus dwells in me. My body is a temple for the Holy Spirit, redeemed, cleansed, and sanctified by the blood of Jesus. I am a child of the living God. I claim my victory in the name of Jesus over all the works of the devil. Satan, you are a defeated foe. I resist you in the name of Jesus Christ. I overcome you by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of my testimony. I am anointed by the power of the Holy Spirit to serve my King and Master, Christ Jesus. Heavenly Father, I give you all the glory, honor, praise, and worship. The Bible says you are Jehovah Nissi, which means the Lord is my victorious banner. I thank you, Father, for the victory I have in the wonderful name of your beloved Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Prayer 2 Father, we thank you for making us see a new year. There were many that desired to see this new year, but they were unable to. It is not that we are better than them, or that we are more righteous than them, it's just because of your mercy. Thank you, Lord, for your many mercies, because they encompass us like a shield and protect us from the fiery darts of the wicked. We thank you for the many battles, seen and unseen, that you fought on our behalf last year. Thank you for not allowing the enemy to have the last laugh over our lives and that of our loved ones. We bless you because you are holy and righteous and faithful and your eyes are ever upon us. Blessed be your holy name in the name of Jesus. Prayer 3 Dear Lord, I pray that in this new year you will cause me to be in the center of your will for my life. Please do not let me stray from your presence, but rather help me to keep my eyes focused on you. Let every step I take and every decision I make be in line with your will for my life. I pray I will be in the center of your will maritally, spiritually, in my career or business, and in everything I lay my hands on. Prayer 4. I pray for spiritual growth in this new year, that my spiritual life will not be stagnant, and that I will be a good ambassador of Christ. Lord, please show me the steps I need to take to grow spiritually. Open my eyes to see those things that I need to let go. And give me the grace to embrace what must be done for me to grow up unto you in all things. As I take steps to pursue faith and holiness with a good conscience, O oh Lord, please back me up in Jesus' name. Amen. Day 12. Pray for victory in health. Scripture reference, Psalms chapter 38 verse 3. There is no soundness in my flesh because of your indignation. There is no health in my bones because of my sin. Scripture reference, Matthew chapter 9 verse 12 to 13. But when Jesus heard this, he said, It is not those who are healthy who need a physician, but those who are sick. But go and learn what this means. I desire compassion and not sacrifice, for I did not come to call the righteous, but sinners. Scripture reference, Luke chapter 5, verse 31 to 32. And Jesus answered and said to them, It is not those who are well who need a physician, but those who are sick. I have not come to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. Scripture reference, Exodus chapter 15, verse 2. The Lord is my strength and song and he has become my salvation. This is my God, and I will praise him, my Father's God, 
and I will extol him. Let us pray. Father God, many of us need healing. I need healing for past hearts, random physical pains that I allow to waylay my days and spiritual healing for various reasons. I reach up to you to receive this healing so that I may be whole and that I may be able to then minister to others in a way that brings you fullness of glory. How wonderful to be able to worship you without stain or blemish and to be totally healed. Show others your healing power so that they may also be healed and walk in wholeness. In the precious name of Jesus, Amen. Mm -hmm.